Hi students, this is Alex here. In this problem, there is a function f of x which is 1 minus x power 2 by 3. We have to show f of minus 1 equal to f of 1 but there is no number c in open interval minus 1 comma 1 such that f dash of c equal to 0. This is the first part. So let's find f of minus 1. When we find f of minus 1, we have to substitute in place of x as minus 1. Then this can be rewritten as minus 1 whole square then whole power 1 by 3. This 2 by 3 I wrote it as 2 into 1 by 3. Then 1 minus when I square this it will become positive. Then 1 power 1 by 3 when I take the real root it is 1. So 1 minus 1 0. In the same way f of 1 equal to 1 minus 1 power 2 by 3. Again rewriting this 1 square then power 1 by 3. Once again we get 1 minus 1 power 1 by 3 taking the real root alone 1 minus 1 which is 0. So we get f of minus 1 equal to f of 1. So we got the first part. But there is no number c in this interval so that f dash of c equal to 0. Let us find f dash of x. f of x is given as 1 minus x power 2 by 3. Now f dash of x is differentiation of 1 is 0 and x power 2 by 3 is minus 2 by 3 x power 2 by 3 minus 1. By simplifying this minus 2 by 3 x power minus 1 by 3. Again further rearranging we get f dash of x is equal to minus 2 by 3 x power 1 by 3. Let us change this in terms of c. f dash of c equal to minus 2 by 3 c power 1 by 3. If I want this to be 0 then c should be infinity. Only then anything divided by infinity is 0. But this infinity does not belong to the given interval minus 1 comma 1. So in the question they have given there is no number c in this open interval such that f dash of c equal to 0. We do not get the value of c in this interval because infinity is not defined. So no value of c in minus 1 comma 1. But as per the Rolle's theorem, we have to get a value of c in the interval. But here we notice that f dash of x is minus 2 by 3 x power 1 by 3. And this does not exist when x is 0. So this we have to say. Since f dash of x is minus 2 by 3 into x power 1 by 3. it does not exist when x equal to 0. When x is 0 then this become infinity and the derivative does not exist. Therefore, it is not differentiable in minus 1 comma 1 because 0 is a part of this interval. Therefore, it does not contradict Rolle's theorem because when there is no value of c in the given interval, it has to contradict the Rolle's theorem, but it is already not differentiable. So, it does not contradict the Rolle's theorem. So as for the question, f of x is given, we prove this part and we try to find the c in this interval, we are not able to find. So it does not satisfy the Rolle's theorem, but when there is no value of c available in this interval, we find 
the function itself not differentiable in the given interval minus 1, 1. So hence it does not contradict the Rolle's theorem.